Hi everyone, I'm meteorologist TJ Del Santo. Happy New Year. We're just a few hours left until uh, 2019 begins. This will likely go down as the third wettest year on record for Providence. It's possible tonight we could actually make it the uh, 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 second wettest on record. Bottom line, it's been a soggy year and what fitting way to end the year but with a rain and windstorm. All right, let's uh, take a, just a quick look at the uh, forecast for this evening. Showers likely by 8 p.m., widespread rain, maybe heavy at times after 10 p.m. with some uh, gusty southeasterly winds developing. Temperatures pretty much holding steady right around 40 degrees or so. All right, let's take a, a look at the whole situation. We've got a lot of graphics to show you tonight. You can see the rain already advancing in, uh, probably starting between 5 and 7 p.m. from west to east here in southern New England. There's the rainstorm right now, uh, currently working through the Great Lakes, and you can see a pretty good squall line right in here. Let's see if we can stop that. Uh, you can see the squall line right Right in here, pretty decent uh, amount of uh, rain, even some uh, thunder there. Let's take a look at the hour-by-hour -hour forecast. We're going to go through this uh, throughout the uh, course of the evening and kind of dissect this storm. Here we are around 8 o'clock or so with uh, rain pretty much everywhere. And as we uh, continue to look at the rest of the evening, we will find some batches of heavy rain arriving, likely after 10 o'clock. Notice the yellows and oranges in here just ahead of the warm front will likely be seen some fairly heavy rain maybe even a rumble of thunder after midnight and probably before three four o'clock in the morning or so don't be surprised if you get woken up by uh, uh, that rumble of thunder and some pretty gusty winds at three o'clock in the morning as well here we are around eight o'clock in the morning maybe some lingering rain showers but the heaviest of the rain should be done at this time of the morning we could find some of the strongest winds over the next 24 hours seven eight nine o'clock in the morning cold front comes on through gets rid of all that moisture skies will be clearing up but still looking at some pretty gusty winds as we go through the uh, daytime tomorrow could be looking at wind gusts to uh, 40 50 miles an hour tomorrow morning winds begin to die down a little bit as we head into tomorrow evening uh, yeah well, we had a, a wet year and we could be seeing another inch to maybe close to two inches in some spots uh, by tomorrow morning maybe an inch and a third in providence maybe 1.7 in westerly all right let's talk about winds now and midnight tonight could be looking at wind gusts between 20 and 30 miles an hour here in southern new england jump ahead into tomorrow morning uh three o'clock in the morning maybe gusting to 40 41 miles an hour in newport maybe 48 mile an hour gusts out there on the vineyard continuing into tomorrow morning between 30 and 40 mile an hour gusts pretty much everywhere and at that time of the morning we may actually uh, get some power outages take you into the rest of the day notice how the winds kind of die down here's a good ch chart to kind of get an idea of what the wind gust potential will be notice the uh, fairly gusty winds just after midnight but notice that peak right around uh, seven o'clock tomorrow morning we could be looking at some gusts to 39 miles an hour that's just in providence taking a look at the south coast and we'll concentrate on narragansett and you can see we could be looking at some wind gusts to perhaps 43 miles an hour seven o'clock in the morning so this is the peak time for the potential of power outages on tuesday morning we have a wind advisory it goes into effect uh, from 9 p.m tonight now until three o'clock tomorrow morning could be seeing some wind gusts to 50 miles an hour we mentioned the possibility of power outages slight chance of power outages across all of southern new england but if you look closely out across uh, martha's vineyard and nantucket we've got a, a moderate chance of power outages the winds will be a little gustier out there so that's why we're expecting maybe a little bit more uh, of a potential for power outages there aren't any leaves on the trees this time of year so you know you get 40 50 mile an hour wind gusts not as strong as they are in the summertime or in the fall all right so that's what we're expecting tonight rain and wind throughout the late evening especially and into tomorrow morning and of course some strong wind gusts through the morning tomorrow we'll have more updates for you throughout the course of the night and if uh, you don't hear from me until then, Happy New Year.